Electric vehicles have had their ups and downs over the last two decades. But we an electric motor is used in an electric vehicle, EV, rather than an internal combustion engine that burns a mixture of gasoline and gases to generate power. History The first functional models were created at the end of the 19th century. Until the 1920s, electric vehicles were widely used in the United States. During the early century, one of the most active users of electric cars was Germany. They have been regularly used in England since 1947. Anjos Jedlik, a Hungarian inventor, created an electrically powered car that looked more like a skateboard than the automobile in 1828. The first car, which was more of a cart, was made in 1841. In 1899, a car with a bullet body made by La Jamais was the one to break the 100 km barrier. The record for one single charge was 167 km on one charge. At first, the disadvantage of the electric car was its complex charging system. Growth. Isn't it amazing that the electric vehicle market today? After a decade of non-stop growth, the global electric car stock surpassed 10 million units in 2020, a rise of 43% over 2019 and a 1% stock share. In 2020, battery electric vehicles will account for two-thirds of new electric car registrations and two-thirds of the stock. BEVs. Adding a cherry on the top, the number of light electric vehicles sold worldwide in 2019 was 9% higher than 2018. This was a significant departure from the preceding six years' growth rates, which ranged from 46% to 69%, and it was just wow. This transition resulted in sales declines in the two major markets, China and the United States, in the second half of 2019. Despite stagnant growth in the two largest countries, global EV sales increased, kudos to Europe as it recorded a 44% increase. Market The global electric vehicle market was worth $163.01 billion in 2020, and it is expected to grow to $823.75 billion by 2030, with a CAGR of 18.2% from 2021 to 2030. Within a few years, wireless car charging will be available everywhere. In Phase 2, an innovative wireless charging system will be embedded underground, perhaps in the right-hand lane of a highway. It will be amazing how motorists can recharge their electric cars while driving. Automatic emergency braking with pedestrian recognition, adaptive cruise control with stop and start, active lane control, and automatic high beams are among the features available. The back seat is roomy and has plenty of cargo capacity, making it ideal for four adults and their belongings. The battery is hidden beneath the car's floor, allowing maximum space. When you get behind the wheel, the electrified Mustang feels agile and speedy. The sportiest models are touted to touch 60 miles per hour in 3.5 seconds. The fantastic thing is that the recent development of self-driving trucks will impact the electric vehicle market. If you dig more, you will get to know that top automakers like Tesla, Volvo, Vera, and Daimler have been working on self-driving electric vehicles for the market. Waymo, Uber, Embark, Einride, Too Simple, and Ike are among the companies working on self-driving electric cars. Tesla, for example, has stated that it is self-driving electric truck will be available by the end of 2022. The top 10 electric cars so far by the graphs are given below. Hyundai Ioniq 5. Kia EV6. Skoda and Yak. Flat 500. BMW i4. BMW iX. Ford Mustang Mach-E. Porsche Taycan. Tesla Model 3 Tesla Model Y Future According to Ramez Nam, co-chair for Energy and Environment at Singularity University in California, we're on the edge of a tipping point. He feels the game will be over if electric vehicles become cost-competitive with fossil fuel automobiles. Elon Musk, Tesla's self-proclaimed techno king, indeed believes this. Last month, he told investors that the Model 3 had become the world's best-selling luxury sedan and that the newer, cheaper Model Y would become the best-selling car of any kind. Mr. Musk told the gathering, we've seen a meaningful shift in customer perception of electric vehicles, and our demand is the best we've ever seen. Electric vehicles are the future of the world, whether we want them. They will take over the world soon. We are now on the verge of an EV revolution. After a period of stagnation, electric vehicles are regaining appeal, with numerous automakers releasing new models each year. Let's look at where the technology for electric vehicles came from and what the future of electrical vehicles hold. But before we get started, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. Market The worldwide electric vehicle market was valued at $163.01 billion in 2020 
and is predicted to increase to $823.75 billion by 2030, at an 18.2% CAGR from 2021 to 2030. By the end of 2020, the world's highways would have 10 million electric vehicles. Furthermore, despite the pandemic-related global downturn in car sales, which decreased by 16%, electric car registrations surged by 41% in 2020. Globally, around 3 million electric vehicles were sold. Electric bus and truck registrations have also increased in key markets, with global stocks reaching 600,000 and 31,000 respectively. From 2017 to 2019, China accounted for more than half of worldwide EV sales, but that dynamic altered in 2020, as EV sales in Europe more than tripled. Various policy tools on both the demand and supply sides are being employed to encourage this expansion. EV sales in North America are slowing, but the Biden administration is proposing $174 billion in expenditures to boost the EV business ahead, which, when combined with new fuel economy standards, might cover the gap with China and Europe. The majority of plug-in cars sold globally are battery electric vehicles, or BEVs, while sales of plug-in hybrids, or PHEVs, are increasing rapidly in Europe. Vehicle makers have declared bolder ambitions for electrification. Out of the world's top 20 vehicle manufacturers, which account for over 90% of new car registrations in 2020, 18 have indicated plans to expand their model portfolio and swiftly expand the production of light-duty electric cars. Electric heavy-duty vehicle model availability is also expanding, with four major truck manufacturers projecting an all-electric future. In 2020, increasing consumers in electric vehicle purchases is expected to reach U.S. $120 billion. In parallel, governments throughout the world spent $14 billion to encourage the sale of electric vehicles, a 25% increase from 2019 owing mostly to higher incentives in Europe. Nonetheless, the proportion of government subsidies and overall spending on electrical vehicles has fallen over the last five years, indicating that EVs are becoming more appealing to customers. In 2020, the global average BEV price was approximately $40,000, while a PHEV price was around $50,000. Despite this, the percentage of government incentives and overall EV investment has been declining from around 20% in 2015 to 10% in 2020. The whole rise in government investment occurred in Europe when several governments responded to the pandemic-induced economic crisis with incentive schemes that increased electric vehicle sales. Analysts project that by 2040, electric vehicles will account for around half of all vehicles sold globally. EV sales alone might generate billions of dollars in income. With gasoline costs steadily rising, more people are contemplating electric vehicles as an alternative mode of transportation, bringing up unlimited possibilities for manufacturers in terms of future profitability and income. Here are the top 10 global EV manufacturers. Nissan Motor, Tesla Inc., Toyota Motor, Ford Motor, Volkswagen, BMW, General Motors, Daimler AG, Hyundai Motor, and Mitsubishi Motors. History. At the end of the 19th century, the first functional models were built. Electric cars were frequently utilized in the United States until the 1920s. Germany was one of the most active adopters of electric automobiles in the early 20th century. Since 1947, they have been used regularly in England. In 1828, Anjos Jedlik, a Hungarian inventor, designed an electrically driven cart that resembled a skateboard. In 1841, the first vehicle, which was more of a cart, was built. In 1899, a vehicle built by La Jamais with a bullet body came the first to cross the 100-kilometer barrier. On a single charge, the record was 167 kilometers. The electric car's first shortcoming was its complicated charging infrastructure. Future We all know and think that electric vehicles or EVs will rule the future of private vehicles. Even though they currently account for a small portion of the entire auto industry and gas cars continue to dominate the private car market, the situation is set to change shortly. The electric vehicle market is expanding at a furious pace. Electric vehicles will outsell conventional autos by 2030, according to industry analysts. Unlike typical gasoline-powered vehicles, purchasing and operating electric vehicles may soon be less expensive or comparable. They're also better for the environment because they don't generate any emissions and so don't pollute the environment, and they can be charged with renewable energy. 
The quick adoption of such technology by the general public is largely due to the breakthroughs in the field of electric vehicles by major manufacturers. This article will look at the top 10 electric vehicle manufacturers in the world. It won't be long before electric vehicles catch up to and overtake conventional automobiles. Electric vehicles are excellent for the environment. As electric vehicles replace gasoline-powered vehicles as the most prevalent means of transportation, air pollution will substantially decrease. Top 10 Best Electric Cars So Far Number 1. Hyundai Ioniq 5 Number 2. Kia EV6 Number 3. Skoda Enya Number 4. Fiat 500 Number 5. BMW i4 Number 6. BMW iX Number 7. Ford Mustang Mach-E Number 8. Porsche Taycan Number 9. Tesla Model 3 and number 10, Tesla Model Y. So guys, that was it for this video. What did you think about our video? Let us know in the comment section below. And if you are new to our channel, be sure to subscribe and ring that notification bell to get notified about our latest videos. Thanks for watching. Who killed the electric car? Just imagine that you are a venture investor like Elon Musk who has the ambition to become new world tycoon in electric cars. How will you conquer the car market from scratch? How is sweet this market in terms of future revenues? Electric vehicle market worth 957.42 billion US dollars by 2030 registering a CAGR of 24.51% report by Market Research Future MRFR. According to a comprehensive research report by Market Research Future MRFR, Electric Vehicle Market Research Report, Technology, Vehicle Type and Region Forecast till 2030, the market is projected to be worth 957.42 billion US dollars by 2030, registering a CAGR of 24.51% during the forecast period. 2022 to 2030, the market was valued at 208.95 billion US dollars in 2021. The top global electric vehicles EV, market research reports are Nissan Motor. Nissan today unveils Nissan EV360, a 1 billion pound flagship electric vehicle EV, hub creating a world first EV manufacturing ecosystem. The transformational project has been launched with an initial 1 billion pound investment by Nissan and its partners in Vision AESC, a global player in world leading battery technology Nissan EV360 brings together electric vehicles, renewable energy, and battery production, setting a blueprint for the future of the automotive industry. Building on over 30 years of history in the area, this is a pivotal moment in our electric vehicle revolution and securing its future for decades to come. Tesla Incorporated. The Model 3 is the all-time best-selling plug-in electric car worldwide and, in June 2021, became the first electric car to sell 1 million units globally. Tesla's global sales were 936,222 cars in 2021, an 87% increase over the previous year, and cumulative sales totaled 2.3 million cars at the end of 2021. Tesla has proven that electric vehicles can be desirable, combining outstanding performance and high-tech interiors with a usable driving range. The Model X crossover has room for up to seven. It's also the most expensive Tesla, featuring the unique Falcon wing doors. Ford Motor Ford offers you the largest public charging network in North America, on the road, Ford customers will have simple and easy access to the Blue Oval trademark charge network the largest public charging network in North America offered by automotive manufacturers. With over 19,500 charging stations in growing, these stations are as common as some of the most popular pharmacy or coffee chains. Volkswagen Volkswagen offers the E-Up, 02 and the E-Golf 03 as full electric models. An entirely new generation of full electric vehicles is to be launched from 2020, the ID family. These cars will be based on the new modular electric drive matrix, and maybe each of the new ID models has a range comparable with current petrol models. BMW BMW's luxurious all-electric executive sedan will soon be hitting the streets. And now you can be among the very first to drive the future, with the first models arriving in early 2023. General Motors 
GM is on its way to an all-electric future, with a commitment to 30 new global electric vehicles by 2025. We are aggressively going after every aspect of what it takes to put everyone in an EV because we need millions of EVs on the road to make a meaningful impact toward building a zero-emissions future. Daimler AG Daimler launches $47 billion EV push to catch Tesla Mercedes ready to be all-electric by 2030, eight battery plants to be built. The Mercedes-Benz maker will invest more than 40 billion euros, 47 billion dollars, between 2022 and 2030 to develop full electric vehicles and be ready for an all-electric car market by the end of that period. Daimler said that as of 2025, the company expects full electric and hybrid electric cars to make up 50% of sales, earlier than its previous forecast that this would happen by 2030. Hyundai Motor Genesis plans to launch only electric or hydrogen electric vehicles from 2025 under the Futuring Genesis strategy. In addition, it plans to produce a total of eight electrified model lineups by 2030 and expand sales to 400,000 units annually in the global market. As part of this strategy, Genesis recently introduced electrified models of the G80 and GV70, as well as the dedicated electric vehicle GV60. The automaker is committed to becoming a carbon-neutral brand by 2035, not only by electrifying internal combustion engines, but also by reducing carbon emissions across the entire value chain, from raw materials to production. Mitsubishi Motors For decades, Mitsubishi has been at the forefront of creating emissions-reducing technologies, electric cars, and hybrid vehicles designed to preserve and sustain the global environment. In recent years, with the production of Outlander PHEV, Mitsubishi has focused on plug-in hybrid electric vehicle technology, pushing the boundaries of what's possible with hybrids. Before our business campaign history let's use Time Machine and Dream and investigate the of the origin of electric motors. Electric cars have been around a lot longer than today's Tesla Motors or even the General Motors EV of the late 1990s. Today together with you we return back to the past of these engines. Hope you will enjoy it. Battery electric vehicles are the very first and simplest type of car. History credits Hungarian inventor Enios István Jedlik for making the first electric model car in 1828. This was a fresh approach, because we usually we make models of real-life objects. Therefore, we have to credit him for having a huge imagination. His first scientific success came when he invented an electromagnetic rotating device in 1827. This still exists in working order and has all the parts of a DC motor, namely stator, rotor, and commutator. In 1861, he mentioned in correspondence he had invented a dynamo too at the time. If we have an electric motor, a dynamo to create electric current, and batteries then we have the basics for an electric car. The first electric car in the form of a cart with an electric motor was created in 1841. The first electric car appeared in the 1830s powered by non-rechargeable cells. In the 1830s, with Scotland's Robert Anderson, whose motorized carriage was built sometime between 1832 and 39. Batteries, galvanic cells, were not yet rechargeable. Another Scot, Robert Davidson of Aberdeen, built a prototype electric locomotive in 1837 and bigger, better version, demonstrated in 1841, could go 1.5 miles at 4 miles per hour towing 6 tons. But it wasn't until 1859 when rechargeable batteries provided a means for storing electricity on board a vehicle, with the invention of the lead acid battery, and cars became a practical mean of transport. The first human carrying electric vehicle with its own power source was tested along a Paris street in April 1881 by French inventor Gustave Trouvé. By the end of the decade, electric cars were setting land speed records. Jamais Contente, a special record electric vehicle with a bullet body, on April 29, 1899, driven by the racer Camille Genazzi, was the first to break the 100km speed barrier on land. The official speed record was 105.882 km per hour. Later, the famous American electric vehicle designer Walter Baker reached a speed of 130 km per hour. The record for the range on a single charge was set by the electric car of Borland Electric, which traveled 167 km from Chicago to Milwaukee. 
The next day, after recharging, the electric car returned to Chicago on its own. The average speed was 55 kilometers per hour. From 1900 to 1910, electric cars and cars with a steam engine became widespread. At that time, of the total number of U.S. cars, 38% had electric motors, 40% steam, 22% gasoline. A resurgence of interest in electric vehicles occurred in the 1960s due to environmental problems in automobile transport and in the 1970s due to the sharp rise in fuel costs as a result of energy crises. However, after 1982, interest in electric vehicles waned again. This was caused by a sharp change in the oil market and poor performance of pilot batches due to shortages of chemical. In the early 90s, California was one of the most polluted regions in the United States. In the current market of the electric cars after a decade of rapid growth, in 2020 the global electric car stock hit the 10 million mark, a 43% increase over 2019, and representing a 1% stock share. Battery electric vehicles BEVs, accounted for two-thirds of new electric car registrations and two-thirds of the stock in 2020. In 2019, the number of light electric vehicles globally was only 9% higher than in 2018. This was a clear deviation from the growth rates of the previous six years, which were between 46% and 69%. The reasons for this shift were due to the decrease in sales in the second half of 2019 in the two largest markets, China and the USA. The year 2020 did not show a big growth in overall new car registrations.